Hello wig stylists! In our last video, I demonstrated how you can use wefts to create custom parts and wigs and modify the bangs on our chibi. Since we get lots of questions about the bangs on our ponytail styles as well, I'm going to show you how you can use the same technique to alter the jasmine and the genie. This process is going to involve taking out the hair elastic that comes with the wig. The jasmine in particular can be really difficult to retie since it's so long, but it can be done with enough patience. Once you've cut the elastic, use the pointed tip of a comb to part the hair how you would like it. Keep adding or subtracting sections until you are happy with the part, and it's even on both sides. See this corner on the side? This is the spot that goes right in front of your ears, so I used that as a reference on each side. Loosely tie the ponytail hair back and keep it out of the way, and use heat from a hair dryer to tame the hair in the front forward. Time to add the wefts. Place the first piece down so that the hair is coming forward and sew it in place. The second weft you sew down needs to be placed for just a tad more, on top of the first weft. Sew it in place and repeat if necessary. I used three rows of wefts total. Use the end of your comb to separate the weft fibers from the rest of the hair and then iron them back using heat from a hair dryer. Since I didn't cut my wefts long enough, there's a small gap near the top. I'm just going to repeat this process to fill it in. Once that is done, I just heat style the bangs to create a better transition and retie the ponytail. When you wish to retie the tail in the proper position, we recommend doing it on your own head with a helper or using a custom sized wig head that is made to match your head size. Retying this on a regular sized styrofoam head might make the inside feel too tight. For additional sizing tutorials, see the links below in the info box. If you're using a custom sized wig head, secure your wig in place with pins and either tilt the adjustable wig stand or have a helper hold it in the right angle while you detangle and secure. If you're doing this on your own head, secure the wig with bobby pins around your hairline and find some place where you can lean back comfortably. While leaning back, hold the wig in place with your hands and have a helper comb out any tangles before tying it in the correct position with some heavy hair ties. If your ponytail gets messy as you tie it, Grip the tail near the hair elastic and detangle from the bottom, working your way up. And that's how you can alter the bangs on our ponytail wigs. Thanks for watching!